Test, test. Test, test. Let's go. Okay, we got it. Hey, what's going on, Paul? Welcome in. <clears throat> Rebecca, what's up? Welcome in. Yo, Evie, how are you doing? Everything look and sound okay? I had to make a couple of adjustments to the setup. Can I get a thumbs up? Look and sound good? You're all good? All right. Awesome. Well, uh, trying to figure out what to play this morning. And, uh, you know, we've been away on vacation for a little bit. So, uh, I miss all your faces. So, uh, let's have a chill stream. Let's play th my favorite. Doing good, how are you? Hey Jim, we're doing good. My fiance is home, settle down. Alright, let's go. <laughs> What's going on, Donald? Welcome in. Little man's feeling good, thank you so much. The best Mario, I agree. Yo, Epic, what's going on? Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Like I said, I just kind of missed everyone. Uh, you know, it's fun to go on vacation and stuff, but uh, at some point I was like, let's go home. Let's get some streams done. Let's go see the TikTok peeps. Don't think you ever been this early? Let's go. Early bird gets the worm, but the early worm gets eaten. Just remember that. So you got to have a balance there. What's going on, Aaron? Let's see if I still remember how to play video games. Uh-oh. Already off to a bad start. Alright, so how was everyone last week? did get to go to uh, Puerto Rico, so that was fun. Uh, beautiful, beautiful location where we were staying. The only thing that was terrible was uh, come back home and uh, the kiddo's sick, so that's never good. All right, we got everything set up now for the uh, coin ship. We got our score right, we got our coins right. We just have to end on that even number. There we go, got it. <clears throat> oh yeah, Aaron. It's a nice shiny white master's hat. It used to be shinier, uh, I did get it a little dirty. What's going on, Peach? Welcome in, everyone. Again, this is uh, our favorite stream. We call Mario in the Morning, where we play some type of Mario game every morning. This just so happens to be my favorite. What's your favorite Mario? Because this is mine. If you're new here, hit that follow button. Just like uh, Raphael did. Welcome in, Raphael. And Big Hoss with the uh, game controller. Thank you so much for the gift. And wrinkles have a tan? <laughs> no, <laughs> they do not. What's going on, Alexander? How are you? be watching the Ryder Cup uh, I doubt it um we don't do too well in the Ryder Cup what's going on sis welcome in when's the birthday yo retro oldies welcome in how are you I was watching you stream last night guys uh we got a lot of awesome streamers in the chat so if you're new here let me introduce you to a few of them we got Sis, Alexandra, Aaron the Engineer, Claudia the Cookie Monster, Exotic Peach, let's see, Retro Oldies, and Epic Texan. These are some of my awesome friends because they're awesome streamers, and when I'm not streaming myself, I like to watch them stream. So if you would do me a favor and give them a follow and check out their content, we'd all appreciate it. We love helping the gamer community around here. And one way you can do that is by simply supporting your fellow gamer, your fellow streamer. Give each other a follow. Uh-oh. There we go. Always. Always thank you guys for being awesome friends. I needed some uh, good positive energy today, so uh, 
I love it when the awesome positive people show up. So thank you all so much. Hey Jenny, how are you? Welcome in. <clears throat> and here we go. Definitely waiting for the coffee to kick in. Hey, Carol! What you got going on today? You're either fighting chickens or riding scooters. What are you doing today? <laughs> Absolutely. I appreciate your support, Aaron. Today's sis's birthday. I thought it was coming up. Happy birthday, sis. Guys, if you could join me in wishing sis a happy birthday. Sis23344 in the chat there. Thank you so much for the 25 ice cream cones. It's your birthday. You're, you're the one that needs the gift, not me. All right, chat, here we go. First mushroom house of the stream, left, right, center, one, two, three. You never been? Rebecca, you got to go. I went for the first time this year. All right, Carol, pick number two. It's definitely one of those bucket list items you want to uh, check off. <clears throat> it is really awesome. All right, starting off on a good foot. We got the brown leaf right out the gate. Hey, Chris, how are you? Definitely a fall leaf. Isn't it weird how they uh, change colors? In the game, I mean. It went from green to uh, brown. It's good to see everyone else, I assure you. <clears throat> you know, as much fun as I have on vacation and stuff, uh, my favorite thing that I do recently is I uh, do a stream for you guys. And uh, it definitely is uh, a big part of my lifestyle now. I just love streaming. And when I don't get to stream, I can feel it, you know? I feel like uh, there's not enough balance in the force, you know? <clears throat> Hey, good morning, Brittany. How are you? Arm still hurts. Ah, oh, that's terrible. Brittany with the galaxy. What? Thank you so much, Brittany. I certainly appreciate that. That's amazing. Thank you so much. Yes, I did come down to the Masters. Uh, I don't have friends. Um, Marani? Marani? I'm sorry if I didn't pronounce that right. Vero, thank you so much for the follow. Guys, if you're new here, hit that follow button. We'd love to have you be a part of TikTok Retro Gaming Family. Yo, Game Daddy, what's up? You know exactly what I mean when you don't get that uh, nice Italian pipe, right? <laughs> Guys, go check out uh, Game Daddy too. Uh, another streamer I like to stop by and frequent. <laughs> Number one, good guess, Carl. Puerto Rico had no spiders. <laughs> no, they had crabs, no spiders. I know about the legend of the pipe. You know, the, the rumors have spread far and wide of the great Italian pipe, but they have yet to do it justice. Yes, been to the Masters. First time this year. It's been, uh, I believe it was 12 years trying to get tickets and finally got tickets this year. No, we did not do the challenge. Um, when I was supposed to do the challenge, guys, this is the, this is going to sound uh, weird and like a cop out, but it's totally not. Um, I made myself sick accidentally by playing my uh, VR headset, the Oculus Quest 2. Um... The first time I ever played the uh, Oculus Quest 2, you know, the VR headset, I didn't realize that it, I would get motion sickness from it. 
and I played it for so long because I was so excited about it that I was sick for two days. And uh, after a while, I got used to it. Well, I put the thing up and hadn't played it in months and months and months. And then uh, I broke it out because my little one wanted to play. And I started playing a new game. It was really, really fun. I was having a good time. I probably had too much whiskey. And uh, I made myself sick again from uh, Vertigo. So that's why the challenge got delayed. And then I went on vacation. So uh, we are going to do the uh, challenge. I just have to get with my partner in the Ordinary Gamer, the GOAT, and see when he's available. Um, it will probably be next week, though, when I have more time off. And SAJ, thank you so much for those gifts. The three fireballs, GGs, and sunglasses. Joker, what's going on? Rona D. Joker, guys. Go check him out. Give him a follow, please. We got him so close to 1K. We just need a few more followers there. But yeah, I apologize for that. It seemed uh, really, really weird at the time. But if you never have vertigo, I hope you don't. But that being said, uh, I really do love the uh, Oculus Quest. And if you have one, add me on there. First time you've been here? Well, welcome in, Game Daddy. I've been in your stream a few times. I don't have friends. I got, I got family. family. That's right. Thank you so much for hitting that follow button, Chris. If you're new here, hit that follow button and you'll get a personal welcome from Vin Diesel. I don't have friends. I got family. Rob, welcome in. we go art fronts thank you so much for the follow welcome into the tiktok retro gaming family let's go well the reason why i put that in there is uh i don't consider you, uh everyone here viewers or a follower i consider you family i want this to be a fun safe place you can come hang out talk about video games or whatever laugh have a good time just forget about the real world for a bit. Spread a little positivity in, in this negative world. Thank you so much for the heart, me, Chris. Let's go. Thank you, Allie. Everyone's welcome here. Have a good time. If you don't want to have a good time, we'll show you the door. But I'd rather you stay in and have fun. Why does my two-year-old insist on eating markers? I don't know. I guess it's the, the smell, right? Thank you, Brittany. I appreciate your positivity. Always showing up and being positive as well. Love surrounding myself with good energy. It's the best way to be. Yeah, those sending markers with those uh, carcinogen chemicals. <laughs> uh, Chris Turner with the five GGs. Thank you so much. Darn it, where was that at? There we go. Got lucky there. There he is. M the Ordinary Gamer, guys. If you're not following M the Ordinary Gamer, please check him out. Go give him a follow. He is the GOAT. And, uh, hopefully, Mario, what do you think? Next week, for the, uh, Tarantula Challenge, we will be trying to eat this Tarantula. I would like to try for next week sometime, Mario, if you're available. Absolutely, Game Daddy. Cool. Just let me know what your availabil availability is. Uh, Monday, Tuesday, or Friday would be good for me. I just would really like to hype it up. Chris Turner picking number one right out the gate. No more VR. Well, Carol, I found out the trick. I got to take Dramamine. The Dramamine helps. Spicy plant. That's right. 
<laughs> it is real. <laughs> it is real. Look at that. Ah, we gotta eat that thing. What are you talking about? Luckily, I'm uh, back on my carnivore diet where I only eat animal and animal products, and this does qualify for that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, jump scare. <laughs> Definitely thick in the middle. Ooh. Fat bottom spiders. Good band name. <laughs> Wait, did Queen already copyright that? Yeah, I really think that's going to be the toughest part of uh, eating this thing. Is uh, I don't know how that that part's going to be. Like, is it going to be like one of those gushers? You bite down on it and just, you know? Is it going to have a thousand eggs inside of it? I don't know. Oh no, no blue cheese. We're just gonna raw dog it. We're just gonna pop it in and eat it dry. Get that gusher. I hope it's not like a gusher. <clears throat> I hope it's empty. Would have to eat that with my eyes. Yes. Um. I don't know what the strat's gonna be. Do, do you just fit it in all at once? Do you eat a little bit at the time? I don't know. Um, the hardest part for me is probably gonna be picking the darn thing up. Uh, I don't like spiders at all. So uh, I'm not exactly happy about doing this. <laughs> so, but that's part of the challenge. We're gonna prove that you can do anything with the right mental state. And no matter what you're going through, if you keep a strong mental state, you can get through anything, including having a huge phobia of spiders and eating one. So, don't chew, just swallow. Oh, I don't know if I could swallow it whole, though. What's going on, Lou? Welcome in. I am, I am. But, uh, again, we would normally do the uh, one chip challenge, where we eat the world's spiciest chip. And uh, that was difficult, but doable. But since they pulled the one chip challenge off the shelves and the prices are skyrocketing on the secondary market, we tried to come up with something new. And uh, this was about the biggest fear I could think of. And uh, definitely a challenge, so we're going to get it done. Soak it in whiskey. Yeah, I think uh, that would take away from it. So we're definitely just going to pop it in, raw dog it. See how it goes. There we go, get them two ups. Let's go. Vamos. <laughs> Vamos Fendi, Mario. It's gonna be like, cheers, bon appetit. <sighs> Welcome in, Sarah. How are you? I don't have friends. Mm. I got family. Martin, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Oh, I was way too early. What was I thinking? Uh, no, I think I left that one downstairs. But I do have that. Uh, game Daddy. <laughs> I hope so. I hope we do get it. I mean, and, and even if we don't, uh, I figure worst case scenario is uh, I'll throw up on a live stream. But I think we could get through it. But uh, it's for a good cause. You know, um, if you don't know about the reason why we're doing this is uh, one, the challenge. You know, just showing people what you can get through with a proper mental mindset. But also uh, a marine brother of mine is suffering from ALS. 
and it is a horrible horrible disease so we are going to uh, try to raise money for him are you coming to the wedding what what wedding Jesse thank you so much for the follow welcome in Oh my goodness, that, that's good to know. <laughs> that's good to know. All right, we got that white mushroom house. Danny hitting the follow button. Welcome in, Danny. We got that ship anchor. Mario's wedding to Queen of Denmark. That's a joke. For, oh. I guess I'm behind on the uh, inside jokes. Said there was no taste. Let's go. <laughs> hey. Have to make a French vanilla cake. All right. What? We're going to have a competition for the best man. <laughs> So all you have to get past is the fear. Well, easier said than done, I guess, but uh, we'll see what we can do. He's accepting video invitation. Thank you for the uh, GG's, Chris. Oh my goodness. I'll admit I was into this uh, wedding talk here a bit too much. the worst I haven't died in this castle since the old cat was a kitten here goes our deathless run There we go. That's what happens when you focus. All right, Game Daddy, thanks so much for stopping by. Appreciate the support. Go check out Game Daddy. Give him a follow. Do not read the chat. I know, right? Thank you so much for the follow. Sarah's picking number three. Let's see what you got. Sarah! We got the dots. Hey, good morning, Maria. MTG. Good morning. I don't have friends. Jordan, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Let's go ahead and put that mushroom to work. What's my favorite kind of cake? I like red velvet cake. I'll take a mushroom. You never know when getting a little big might come in handy. cake or carrot well you like the red velvet too nice oh no we're stinking it up <laughs> was that a request I made a red velvet cake at work hey nice but 
banana chocolate chip. Nice. Banana chocolate chip coffee. Love the carrot cake from Cheesecake Factory. I hear the carrot cake at uh, the Bellagio. I hear this really, really good. If you go uh, out to Vegas and stop by Bellagio, I hear their carrot cake is top tier. Hey, Courtney, welcome in. Got to figure out. Yeah, I always do uh, ice cream cake as well. When in doubt, I'll do an ice cream cake. pie over cake I don't prefer a whole lot of pies ice cream cake as a kid yep yes I'm from Georgia oh no oh my goodness From Augusta? I'm from uh, right in the middle in uh, Macon. Best pie shops in the country? Nice. That's when Donald's blow. That's alright though. We got the five ups. You're from Augusta? Nice. That's where I got this hat. Over cake. Left, right, center. One, two, three. I love this game. One of my favorites. Yes, this is definitely one of my favorites. Sarah's picking number two. One of my favorites as well. If you uh, like this type of content, hit that follow button because we play this one all the time. Yeah, I went to the uh, Augusta Nationals this year and uh, got to watch some of the Masters, and that was quite the adventure. Oh, what? Come on. Boy. Well, that's no fun. Oof on purpose, because I hate not doing the uh, secret. Yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, oof here in the hole and start over. Be a dream to go there? It definitely uh, was what everyone says it is, Chris. Chicken nuggets keep fighting. Zay, thank you so much for the uh, GG. Thank you so much for the gift. Love to go to the Masters. It, even if you care nothing about golf, and I'm just a fringe golf fan. Like, I I don't watch every tournament. I don't know everything there is to know about golf, but I'm familiar with it. And um, I've always heard, hey, you got to go. It's one of those bucket list things just to see the uh, course, how beautiful it is. Absolutely stunning. Oh yeah, we're gonna get all the whistles. Always. Well, I hope we even get through this level. I'm not on my game. Take a little vacation, you forget how to play the game. Uh, I was thinking of doing some of the uh, SMB3 Kaizos, but I'm just not very good at those. They are super, super difficult. So when you see like a uh, Boonie Veteran and M the Ordinary Gamer playing those uh, Super Mario Brother 3 Kaizos, I hope you appreciate how difficult those are. Love the Mario Brothers 3. I bought it on the Wii Virtual. Nice.
No, it's 100% harder. I can vouch for that. I don't have friends. I friends. Yeah, I was watching uh, Eddie play uh, Kyle Bros. And uh, I remember Booney struggled with that one for a bit in certain areas. I mean, he always completes them because he persists until he succeeds and he's just that talented. Thank you so much for the follow. I can't pronounce your name properly. Aetherbolt94, thank you so much for the follow. Oh my goodness, get up there. Getting new controllers for a switch. I like the uh, VR, it's fun, uh, but it will make you sick if you're not used to it. Ask me how I know. Johnny, thank you so much. John, thank you so much for the uh, heart me gift. Appreciate the support. Oh, you're trying that one? Dang, Mario. That one looked tough. I mean, I know you're the goat and you'll beat it, but, uh, man, those look tough. Pink Puff! Guys, go check out Pink Puff. Give her a follow as well. Pink Puff Gaming in the chat. Another fun stream. I love to stop by. Oh, no. What is going on today, Mario? It's the spy. <laughs> it's the rust. We gotta knock the rust off. But it is hammer time. Let's go. Left, right, center, one, two, three. These are all going to be frog suits. Let's just open up one. Okay, Carol picked two. Carol's fast on the vacation got me exact. Well, not so much vacation. It was the uh, little one being sick. That was a rough night. And into the morning. Couldn't get him to take his medication. It was rough stuff. We are using up all of our power ups. Yeah, he was sick. He uh he had strep throat. And you know, if you don't take your medicine, it just doesn't get better and progressively gets worse. So I was getting real worried about him because he was having a hard time taking the medicine. It was a whole ordeal. Oh my goodness. And in his defense, the medication did taste like garbage, to be polite. Player two was down, yeah. He's, he tried his best to have uh, good energy, though, so... Charlie, you're halfway there. Now all you have to do is go to the Discord and download all the ROMs. Are you in our Discord? Or my Discord? Alright. I assume you're going to download some of those gems in there. Okay, cool. definitely do um, when you do go live Charlie feel free to use the discord to shout yourself out hey I'm going live 
if you would just not at everyone because uh, that alerts everyone and we try to use that for uh, big notifications but feel free to shout yourself out and that goes for anyone else uh, you know one of our missions is to grow the gamer community on this platform so if you want to use my TikTok to tag me in videos or to shout yourself out during a live stream, feel free to shout yourself out. Hey, I need 1K. Can someone give me a follow? We allow that here. World 4 is the best. Everyone loves Big World. Have you played the... Yes. She put a, a bunch in the uh, Discord, uh, Aaron. I played a few of them. You need 1k button dollars? More money, more problems. That's what I want to say. You never knew that secret about jumping on top? Yeah, I mean, uh, I don't think it was anything too difficult. It depends on which one as well. Fish are gonna get me today. Whew. Yeah, John, I used to write them down on a sheet of notebook paper and I used to keep them next to my uh, Nintendo. And I knew if I turned over these two cards that it would be this one. It, it was either four or five, I don't remember how many it was, but I had all the possibilities laid out too. Hey, good morning, Jessica. Cheap cheeks for a reason. Is there... I'm not sure about that art. Um, not sure about the upscale. And Jessica, thank you so much for the heart me gift. Let's see, I missed it. Sarah's picking number two again. Back to back number two. Let's see what you got. There's eight all together? Okay. Should've got a power up. Oh no, I missed it. <laughs> I was scared of Bertha. I hate that fish. I hate that fish. That's all right. I got something for you this time. There you go. Oh, you back for more? There you go. I do like to kill her with a shell. There you go. I feel like that's pretty satisfying. Boom, got it. Hey, Irina, how are you? I don't have friends. I got family. The fact we all call it Bertha. I know, Cassie, I don't know. Is it Boss Bass? Is that a real name? I don't have friends. 
Lala Soul, thank you so much for the uh, follow. Vexa, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you so much, everyone, for double tapping that screen. We're about to cross 4,000. We're at 3,900. Whoa, we just got a new subscription from John Logan. Thank you so much for the sub. Our subs got kind of low this uh, past month. I apologize. That's probably due to me missing a few streams. Big boss pass, yep. Good morning, Rob. What's going on? Upwind Tunic. Another awesome streamer you need to check out. Nintendo Power Nerd back in the day. Uh, I never did get the subscription, but uh, I used to love to, you know, when you would go into the stores, I would run to the video game section every time. I would uh, obviously read all the Nintendo Power, and when, like, uh, Electronic Gaming Monthly came out and other game magazines started coming out, uh, I was able to get a subscription to those, and that was pretty cool. But uh, by then, Nintendo was uh, fading out. Nintendo Power was. Doing good, Bridget. How are you? You miss Nintendo Power? I always wanted to call the uh, helpline. The Nintendo uh, helpline. But there's no way that would... Uh, No way my parents would allow that. <laughs> Costs like $400 a minute. On break? Nice. Thanks so much for hanging out with us on break. Same here, Kronk. I did the same thing. Or just would memorize them. Mario made me excited as a kid. Yeah, uh, I always say, Chris, that's the reason why I tend to focus on uh, Mario. I mean, you see all the Mario stuff behind me here. Uh, it just makes me happy. I got family. Uh, I love um, all the positive memories that I have with Mario. But uh, yeah, I always uh, keep Mario close. Something. Thank you so much for the follow, Big Dog C, hitting the follow button as well. Thank you so much for the support. Yo, Ghost, what's going on? Ghost is another awesome streamer. Actually taught me a trick on uh, 99 lives, so uh, go check out Ghost. I think you'll like his content as well. Dave is sharing the live video. Thank you so much. Sarah's picking number one. Y'all keep letting Sarah beat ya. Mario's always so nostalgic. Takes him back to carefree childhood. True words have never been spoken. Just Sarah. You own it this morning. They got them fast fingers. Oh, there we go. Chris got you this time, though. Chris got you. Mm. Did you get the secret music box? And f no, we did not do that one. Remember, we talked about it last time. Beating Bowser. You never forget your first time beating Bowser. Oh, that was a fast one. That was a fast one. Anytime you see us going to Mushroom House, shout out your favorite box. Left, right, center, one, two, three. Nope, didn't eat the spider. We still got it right here. Uh, oh, no. I forgot it was auto-scroller. <laughs> but, yeah, uh, we're, we're probably going to do it next week next week. Hey Jenna, good morning, welcome in. I 
Thank you for sharing the live stream as well. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna be scared, scared to eat it too. <laughs> but that's kind of the point, you know? We're gonna uh, try our best to get through it. Nice. Just think of it as a crab? I guess. I mean, as. Uh, I don't know if you're familiar with, uh, there was prison riots back in the 1700s. Uh, the prisoners were tired of always being fed lobsters, so uh, they uh, rioted, and uh, I think several people died. But yes, the prison kept feeding them uh, lobsters and crabs, and you know, that's like a del delicacy nowadays. Scott picking number one. That's what you got, Scott. Yeah, look it up. Uh, I believe it was in the 1700s. Prison rights over lobster. Lobster used to be prison food. How about that? And now they charge uh, $12 a pound for it. <laughs> Those poor prisoners. <laughs> I mean, they must have not had butter, you know? If you don't have butter, I, I can see. I can see a right. Love to have some lobster right about now. Yeah, I haven't had lobster in a while, but when I did, I made a nice uh, butter sauce with uh, rosemary, thyme, and... A lovely Japanese whiskey just mixed a little bit of that inside and it made a great base for the uh, lobster just oh perfect he's much better now Bridget but uh, we've had a rough couple of days what's going on Eddie uh, guys I was watching dear old dad in the chat there Eddie play some awesome Mario last night so go check him out and give him a follow please if you like awesome Mario content. Dang it. Make a mean lobster. Oh, nice. <laughs> I remember uh, when I first started playing The Sims on uh, PC. Uh, I was trying to get a good job with a high salary, and I finally got the job late at night. So I called in sick to my real job so I could go to my fake job in the sense. <laughs> That's a fun memory. She's gonna get me. Oh no. Son of a. <laughs> she got me. She caught me slipping. Yeah, it was rough, Bridget. <laughs> it was rough. It's got me twice today, David. That's unlike me. I, I am feeling a bit rusty, though. And uh, that's what I said. Uh, I want to hang out with my people today. I just want everyone here. And sometimes it's not as much as, about the game than it is uh, seeing all you guys. Get up there. Uh, 
I feel good. Uh, it's just a little one that was sick. Uh, Ellie. I mistimed it just a little bit. Thank you, Sarah. Yeah, it's definitely all about the peoples. Because we are stinking it up today. Oh my goodness gracious. What's going on, Gandhi? Welcome in. It's a hat trick to the fish indeed. Get in the pipe. Yo, thank you so much for the confetti, Eddie. Oh, there we go. There we go. Tattoo Frog Soup Mario. One. Two. Oh, no. Dang it. He got me. Can't wait to cover it up. Exactly, Sarah. Whoever invented water levels, they deserve, like, uneven tire wear, low credit scores, all that bad stuff. Definitely having an off day. I just want to come all the way back over here for nothing. Alright, here's the way I would normally do it. I'll go ahead and wait uh, on Bertha to do her little practice round. And then I come over. And then I do this. Take them both out. Sometimes it's all about rhythm and timing. And uh, if you get off of rhythm and timing. Because you're so used to it being a certain way. And the old adage, don't move unless Bertha's down. So we'll stay right here. We'll wait on Bertha. Uh-oh. I messed with the fireball. That's okay. That's okay. Just go. Just go, Mario. I wish it didn't respond so fast. I know, right? Crystal Morris, good morning, and how are you? Welcome in. My both sides of their pillow always be warm. Exactly. Have a new baby in the family. Nice, Bridget. Mm. We are back. Just call me B. What's up? The great auntie. I keep messing up this 99 lives hack. I just want to pull it off on stream one time. It. -ah. What's going on, Jess? How are you? These levels are so short. Yeah, um, I used to think they were longer when I was a kid, too, but, uh, you know, I've been playing this game for literally 32 years, 33 years, whatever the time is now. And uh, I just play them a certain way every time. It was like riding a bicycle. And uh, I've just gotten used to playing with it. Found a system that works. Hey, good morning, Brian Fibbs. Brian Fibbs, another awesome Mario streamer. Go check him out. Siphon 79. How are you? Muscle memory, exactly. Uh, that's why when I want to have a chill stream, I play Mario 3 because I can look at the chat more and uh, not worry about the game as much. Like if I'm playing Kaizo, I'm hyper focused on the game itself and not on the chat. Is this Battletoads? No, it's definitely not. Uh, Nufi is another awesome streamer. Check out the Mushroom Kingdom there in the chat. Noofy. Who 
is calling me. I know no one from there. Ah, stupid phone call in the middle of a game. Uh, robo calls definitely definitely deserves permanent head lice all right this is gonna be difficult to small Mario let's see if we can pull it off just gotta be a little patient I guess all right let her get her jumps off Okay, okay. Okay, let's go! Woo! Eternally damp socks. Oh my goodness, isn't that the worst? You put on that fresh pair of socks, you walk through the kitchen, step in a puddle. Oh, it's the worst. Newfie, thanks so much for the rose. Headlast is the worst. What's going on, Shasta? Welcome in. Seven pounds, seven ounces, twenty inches long. I will confess the roses have been oopsie. <laughs> Was it oopsie rose? The best world. This is everyone's favorite big world. Speaking of getting big, let's do it. Savage King 07, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome, man. You thought Wendy was gonna get me? Where's your faith at, brother? Where is your faith? You know, uh, Wendy is a tough little villain there. Um, she was always a challenge for me as a kid. So I used to skip World 3 because, uh, one, you'd skip Bertha and Wendy. So, uh, I used to always skip it. Should have gotten you for sure. Not if you practice. The big thing with Wendy is, uh, let her get her jump and her, uh, ring out the way when she throws the ring. <laughs> Bunch of ideas, yeah. Whoa. I'm not gonna risk it for that. Never knew that was there. I'm kinda glad it's just one more. <laughs> you definitely don't want to go up here. Um, the only reason why I go up here is just to show it off to people who don't know about it. But, uh... It's only a couple of extra lives. And to me, it's not really worth it. I mean, we already got plenty of lives. I mean, when we're on our game, we only need like four or five lives, right? Vacation was fun. Quite the experience. I don't know if you've ever driven down and up a mountain road with blind turns and people driving on the wrong side of the road. It's quite the adventure. <laughs> All right, thank you so much for stopping by. Have a good day. <clears throat> Alright, we gotta clear this board. Alright, there we go. We're done with this one. Started watching the stream on here and Twitch. I'm looking to dual stream? Certainly should. Um, I don't do the dual stream. I started using TikTok Live Studio, and I like it better than OBS. Just because I'm not super tech savvy, and TikTok Live Studio just kind of does all the work for you. So, uh, 
I'm kind of enjoying that. What? Anyone that's ever been a perfect in the match game? I got family. My favorite world in the game? Yeah, Jimmy, this is everyone's favorite. Well, I wasn't even looking. We got the five ups. Let's go. Emily Renee, thank you so much for the follow. How many new followers we got? 19. 19 new followers. Left, right, center, one, two, three. Pick your favorite box. First answer I see in chat. The box we will open as always. Thank you so much for stopping by, Aaron. David's picking number two. That spicy plant. Ooh, that was a close one. Ooh, that was a close one. We're playing with fire over here. Too cocky. Got too cocky. <laughs> Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Lacey, thank you so much for the heart and the gift. Ooh, get in the pipe. Let's go. Disagree. Someone get Nintendo's lawyers on the phone. I'll definitely check it out. Blue Finch. Actually, if you want to send it to me uh, in a DM, that would be awesome. Feel free to share it with me. There we go. Sheesh. They're busy currently working with the Wally Coyote. All right. Let's use this dumb thing. Nintendo's Lord. Okay, that's what they're doing. <laughs> Leave Wiley Coyote alone. Dang it. Isn't there something here? Go away, ghost. Yeah, give me that firepower. Get the pipe. Hey, Newt, what's going on? Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh, I remember. I didn't uh, remember until I said it, but I remembered. Welcome in, Brooke. Didn't I see a picture of you wearing a Master Chief helmet? I got family. The official BB89. Thank you so much for the follow. Definitely OP. I didn't use that trick for a very long time either. Yes, were you wearing a Master Chief helmet? Or am I crazy? 
I might be crazy. I knew I wasn't crazy. <laughs> Number two. Oh no, little mushroom. <laughs> oh, uh, when I saw that picture though, it just reminded me of when I first played uh, Halo on the Xbox. I thought that was epic. I was like, oh my goodness, graphics can't get any better than this. smooth as butter. Today, finally, right? Thank you all for the uh, shout outs. All right, here we go. Left, right, center, one, two, three. There could be a Tanuki in one of these boxes. Let's see how good you are. Sarah's picking number three. Let's see if she got that Tanuki. It's my favorite. It's okay, I'll take some firepower. five-year-old he's always playing the switch and stuff and he has recently found out about the rewind button so when he gets an item he doesn't like he just rewinds and go picks another one. Oh, come on I know right I said, buddy, you know, that's uh, cheating, right? He's like, it's not cheating. I just rewind. He's feeling good. He uh, actually was able to go to school because his uh, fever has subsided for 24 hours. And the medication was finally able to get some in him the old-fashioned way. I know it was uh, not fun times for a few days, a couple of days. Butter soup. Thank you. Uh, he was actually able to go to school today. Let's go. Yes, sir. so much for sharing the live stream let's go darn it hit the 
button too soon. I forgot to go fight this guy. Get out of here. They had to steal my water. No, but I can go get some. I got some downstairs. Somebody gave it to me as a Christmas gift. I was not impressed. You know I have high standards. You know the bottom three from the right. Bottom three. Right to left are always the same. No, I didn't know that. Bottom three, right to left are always the same on every board. Okay. Well, they can't be, because the bottom three, right to left, is mostly always a star, right? That was just a mushroom. Dang. Thank you so much for the uh, game controller. Soup on a stick. Bruh. Test that out. There we go. Sometimes if you don't catch this pattern, his jumps are a little weird. Scholar D Moon, thank you so much for sharing the live stream. Well, so we got any new followers in the uh, Discord? If you're new here, hit that follow button. Come join us in the Discord as well. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's right. My personal favorite, World 5. Easton, thanks so much for the follow. I'm going to uh, oof here on purpose. I was trying to pull off a uh, trick for uh, rescue dogs to see if we can get that uh, secret music box in this area. So let's see if we can pull it off. It has been a while since I've done this. So we'll keep that as a backup. Pipe, let's go. Oh, 
What do we do? Is it here? I'm trying to remember what we have to do. Do we fly here? Is it a duck down? Oh, there it is. Got it. Boom. Well, it could have been a little smoother, but we pulled it off. I haven't done that since uh, Moby Dick was a minnow. so much for the uh, follow isotropic phoenix let's go shakalaka <laughs> boom shakalaka that's cool never done that before learn so many things hey we'll stick around see if you learn some more stuff I don't know everything I'll tell you that, I don't know everything, but uh, I bet I know about 98% of it. I know you hit that sub button. Thank you so much for that, John. Do you know about the uh, P-Wing glitch in Bowser's Final Castle? I don't have friends. I got family. Yo, CRS13, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, good. They're all going to be Tanuki, so we'll just open one here. We are running low on power-ups, I just noticed. Das Boot, the Goomba Shoe. Love the Tanuki suit. I think I love the Tanuki suit because uh, it was like one of the first ways I was able to beat Bowser consistently is uh, using that Tanuki suit. The uh, Specifically the uh, statue ability to uh, dodge the fireballs. That really, really helped me beat Bowser. There we go. Sometimes it's a little harder to recover that one. Gotcha. Gotcha. I always get rid of it here though so we can continue on our star streak. That's boot. Hard to get the star in the boot. No, definitely not 100% in it. Um, I normally uh, will just grab a couple of P wings and uh, come over to World 6, pick up the Hammer Bros suit so we can beat Bowser as Hammer Bros. 
and then we'll go uh, World 8, because I hate World 7 with a passion. <laughs> I don't know why I, I like the P-Wings. I guess it's a habit when I was a kid. I, there are certain levels I couldn't beat without P-Wing. So I was like always, always so um, obsessed with getting the P-Wings. Gotta have the P-Wing, gotta have the P-Wing. Definitely not one of my favorites. <laughs> Just because it's difficult. I've always hated it when I was a kid. Um, I wasn't very good at World 7. And I would just always skip it. Alright, thanks for hanging out. World 7 is the uh, pipe world. Alright, these are all gonna be uh, Hammer Bros, so it doesn't matter which one we open. But What's going on, Kevin? Never got that far as a kid. Yeah, it's definitely a tough one, so uh, definitely skip it. Just to refresh your memory, we'll go in there for a minute. Poke our head about. Reminds me, I do need to make a save state here. All right. Save game position in zero, zero. All right. Because I do want to try the 7-1 uh, glitch. Yeah, I would definitely say that as well, B-Dog. Thank you, David. Textbook. Oh, I used to have to do the same thing, John. Uh, I have gotten way more consistent. But uh, to me, it's just a matter of staying in front. If I get out of rhythm, though, sometimes it can be uh, a little... Difficult because I'm used to playing in a certain way. Uh, I used to have to do this as small Mario as I would use all of my power-ups by the time I got here But I figured out a system that worked for me when I was younger And uh, I used to have to be perfect because I had to do it as small Mario Still stuck halfway through world 8 well stick around let me show you some tips and tricks on how to beat world 8 World 8 is super intimidating uh, if you don't know little tips. But stick around, I'll show you how I like to beat World 8. You 
can't play until you fix your Game Boy triggers. Oh, okay. I got family. Ooch, thank you so much for the follow. And you can always go under the boat on this one. But if you stay on top, it's not that difficult either. I've gotten to where I like staying on top more. Hey, good morning, baloney. Try to go to Bowser with 99 lives. I used to be obsessed with the uh, 99 lives trick. Missed this game? Well, you can play it on like a million different. Do you have a Switch, bro? Or a PC? Or an Android device? Why don't you uh, play it on the Switch? Five. Uh, Booney's really good at it. Uh, Booney Veteran, if you don't know him, he's done uh, deathless runs of this. Pretty awesome. You still do Switch giveaways? No, not currently. B Dog, thanks so much for the follow. I don't have friends. I got family. Red Viper 89 hitting the follow button. Thank you so much. JB from NYC. Thank you so much for the heart me gift. It's on the Game Boy. It's on the uh, Super Nintendo. It's on Nintendo. It's on all of the uh, emulators. I don't have friends. Asher hitting the follow button. Thank you so much. Alright, so depending on which hand you get. Some of these are more difficult than the others. This one's pretty easy. If you stay in rhythm. And uh, you do get a power up out of it. So that's always good. I think the game stopped. <laughs> Absolutely. It's like kind of part of your deal. How do you get the old Mario games on the Switch? Silence Who, if you buy the uh, online expansion, you can download all the emulators, Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Nintendo 64, Sega Genesis, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color. You can download all those on the Switch and play these games. Done Deathless Run twice, All Stars a few days ago. I got family. Nice. JB Phillips, thanks so much for hitting the follow button. Welcome into the TikTok retro gaming family. Oh no! I missed time that one. Never use P Wings. Oh, that would be difficult to get through some of those in World 7. No P Wing. So you do have the service, you just don't play the game? This was, was one of the most intimidating levels in the game when I was younger. Not so bad now. Just gotta time the uh, throws. Oh no! Oh no, I had a bad jump there. Okay. All right, back on track. Back on track. That was almost disastrous. As well as that, but we can get, we can make it through this. This is fine. It was not fun. It was not fun. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, 
whole world's falling down around me. This is fine. This is fine. We're just losing all of our power up. It's no biggie. Just taking wrenches to the face like it's my job. Come on, get it together, Jesse. Get your head in the game, son. Son of a... Uh, it's, it's basically random, Casey. Um, there's like a, a very low percentage of you getting, uh, no hands. Push comes to the shove, you gotta break out the old P-Wing. But, uh, yeah, it's not the same every time. Um, I forget the percentage, but it's like a very, very low percentage of the time that you would actually get no hands, which makes this game speedrunning like super, super difficult. Like one out of every 300 speedruns are ruined by the uh, hands and the way the uh, Hammer Brothers move on the screen after you complete a level. You know, the Hammer Brothers tend to move around. I forgot to make an event. Oh, absolutely, Peach. Absolutely posted. Well, only thank you so much. 12%. I actually thought it was lower than that. I thought it was like 7. But yeah, super low percent. One. Two. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. So if you got a P-Wing in your back pocket, pull it out. But as hard as those levels were when I was younger, 8-1 uh, and 8-2 were equally as difficult, if not more so. And uh, I figured out this little trick by accident one time. So you fly up, hit the P-Switch. I got family. Jay Buxton 80, thank you so much for the uh, follow. Welcome in. So then you get your P speed back. You're going to fly up in this direction. You should reach this pipe. Get in the pipe. Get your three ups. All right, now here's the difficult part. You're going to want to maintain P speed as you exit this tunnel and just smash the button as fast as you can. Oops, terrible. Didn't maintain P speed, so P speed, here we go. Alright, mess that up. You gotta use every bit of percentage of your P speed, so don't waste any. Boom, dang it, I mistimed it. Hey Caroline, welcome in. Ah, this, this isn't gonna be the one. We'll make it pretty far here, but we're going to have to uh, adjust to the pipe. And we did not. Dang it. If we would have made it to that pipe, it would have been fine, but we didn't have enough P-Speed. Am I out of... I'm out. Alright, let's just P-Wing it again. Which game systems do you have? I love Mario 3. Um, I've got everything in emulators. But as far as actual systems, I just have uh, PC, uh, Xbox, PS2. Yo, Retro Mamba, what's going on? Go check out Retro Mamba and give him a follow as well. But the point is, you can fly up this way. And if you uh, have enough P-Speed, you'll actually come down over here by these two pipes. Just like that. Got it. It's all about when you hit that P-Speed. Sage code, 
Thank you so much for the uh, two GGs. Appreciate the gifts. And obviously, A2, you fall in the first sand trap. I like to go to the left over here because there's a power up. There's just coins to the right. Is your setup easy? Yeah, it's just a PC. Running an emulator. Download the ROMs. Pretty easy peasy. We use uh, TikTok Live Studio for live streaming, if that's what you're planning on doing. Alright, let's see if we can do a blind fall on this star here. Ah, oh, we missed it. Let's try it again. Come on, let's get a star, let's get a star! Ah. You need the plan right for a GBA switch. Yes, the uh, extension plan. Do you have that? The online extension? It's like $50 a year. Oh, okay. All right, this level is kind of uh, intimidating as well. I used to always skip it by using the cloud. It's really easy if you follow this uh, trick. As soon as you go through this door, be ready to jump. So you get to this door, be ready to jump because you're on that conveyor belt. All right, now you're going to be looking for the door that is on the three stone pedals. Pedals like these three stones I'm standing on. That's the door you're looking for right over there. Go on that door. Hit the P switch. Run. Jump. Don't stop. Don't stop. Jump in the door. Run, run, run. Don't stop. And the last door, the very, very end. Boom. And that's the fortress. Now this uh, fight with the boom boom here is a little tricky because of the conveyor belt. But if you keep your one, two, three rhythm, you should be good to go. Yeah, I always prefer the tail of the firepower. Kelly Sig 301 Taylor's version. Thank you so much for the follow. We should be able to make it through here. No problemo. Just stay in front. Oh yeah, I probably didn't need it at that point though. I don't know why he can't hit me while I'm right in front of him. <laughs> Alright, and that's that. Now we're on to the Bowser's fight. And I have a few ways I like to beat Bowser. So, we'll uh, show you all the different ways to beat Bowser. Yo T, what's going on Tanya Ramon? Another awesome streamer, go check her out and give her a follow, please. Let's create a save file right there. All right, so here's my favorite ways to beat Bowser. First of all, we're gonna do the uh, infamous P Wing glitch, it's my favorite. Been watching since World 4, let's go. LT, thank you so much for the follow, welcome in. 
All right, here we go. If you've seen this, I apologize. I do it all the time because it's my favorite way to beat Bowser. We're gonna fly through here, obviously reserving your P-Wing power. Don't take any damage. Be careful at the Disco Waffles. Duck down, fly on the gap, stand up, and you walk right through the wall. Nice little wall walk. Fly on over. Don't take any damage. Duck down again. Stand up in the gap of that statue. Your wall walk. Again, don't take any damage. Dodge the fireballs and the uh, spicy marinara sauce. Once you get to Bowser's chambers, don't go too far to the right or he'll spawn in. Fly straight up instead. Go to the left. Once you're over this wall, land on this platform. You don't have to do anything, but just touch it and then come back over. And now when Bowser spawns in, you'll notice he isn't throwing any fireballs, so he can't hurt you. As long as you hold down on the uh, controller, he can't do any damage to you. No. Definitely not. So we'll let Bowser do his thing. Just simply hold him down. All we have to do is move out of the way when he makes this final pass. Don't forget to do that. When he jumps up, move. Fly over, go over to the door, hold up. As soon as he oofs, the door will open. And that's that. And then you go inside and get your peaches. And I'll show you another way I like to beat Bowser. Again, we're going to use the star and the uh, Hammer Brother suit. Mike K. Ray, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> Actually, it's just water. I, I got the real deal downstairs, though. I could go get some towel. Let it fall. One, two, three. Nice. Hammer time. This is Mario 3, Shane. Alright, this part's a little tricky. I like to try to land on the uh, very, very first of these little things. There we go. Ooh, can get a little tricky right there. Alright. Now, it's super easy to beat Bowser with these. Just that quick. No, uh, this is actually the Super Nintendo version, Shane. Uh, the All-Star version that was released in 1993. Thank you for the uh, GG's, John. Thank you. So again, you get your peaches. And the way I used to beat Bowser when I was um, younger, when I was a kid, I used to love to use the uh, Tanuki suit. The Tanuki suit gave me an advantage because of the uh, statue ability. So I would turn into a statue like that and use that to uh, dodge Bowser's fireballs. And also dodge the disco waffles if they got close.
And just the same thing. I agree. I agree, John. Definitely one of my favorites. All right. And as I said, the easy thing about fighting Bowser with the Tanuki is you don't have to worry about his fire. So we just turn into the statue, wait for him to make his jump, and now when you go over by the door, he can't fall on your head, so you don't have to worry about that. Just dodge the fire with the statue. He can't hit you, so just go find a place to chill. So again, just hanging out. Frog suit gets the participation ribbon. I like the frog suit specifically for when Mario's running with a shell because it's just funny. <laughs> and there goes Bowser. And that's just a super easy way to beat him. Easy peasy D, that's right. Thank you so much for stopping by, Chris. I don't have friends. Stephen A., thank I you for the follow. Family. Welcome in. I do have a Twitch, uh, Crown Vic Lover. But uh, I don't stream over there often enough. All my people's over here on uh, TikTok. If you want to go follow my YouTube, I'm going to get more deliberate about uploading YouTube videos. So if you want to come join me over there, I'll certainly appreciate it. All the links are in my TikTok bio. If you click the little picture that looks like Mario dressed up as a United States Marine, that'll take you to my TikTok page. Click on the uh, link where it says link tree and it'll take you to all of my social media. Now I gotta figure out something else to play. So let's see, what are we gonna play today? I got a little bit of Kaizo left as far as uh, Love Yourself. <laughs> 